Generation X, you know we like to flex. Gen- we slide, 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 slide. you know we like to flex. Yo, yeah, yeah, we strictly break your necks. When we roll down the street, people rally wanna check. Huh, rally, rally, smoke weed in the alley. Salute, what's good, family? I ain't even gonna hold y'all. Recently, your man Wack 100 was on Clubhouse giving what I like to call his expert analysis on the situation between Quavo, Takeoff, and the Mob Ties boys. You know, Jay Prince sons, right? Now, he gave this analysis based on our witness reports and the footage that DJ Academics broke down. Now, before we even play it, I'm going to ask y'all one question before you listen to what he had to say. Based on the lifestyle that WAC 100 used to live, in the code that he still stands on today, what do you consider what he is doing on Clubhouse? Do you perceive it as a celebrity just creating content or do you see it as somebody that's talking a little bit too much. I'll catch y'all on the back end. Let me know down in the comments how you see it, how you perceive it, and what your opinion is, all right? And to behave when you come to Houston. Now, they don't know, Herman, you know this. Deleting is not deleting when they want to oh, go nah. broke. No, nah, that's shit oh, in the air. That's shit when they want to go broke, right? <laughs> and a lot of these niggas don't know that you can say you want one place, but them, them, them <laughs> cell phone <laughs> towers... Don't put you right where you was at. Absolutely. They'll put right. your ass right there. Yeah, yeah, right. So, even when it's off, so, you get it like off. So now, dude goes. You come to my town. Yeah, dude goes, on some, dude goes on some trolling shit and reports he being killed, which in turn, they put a lot of attention on him. He looking for the likes. He want everybody to know who oh, he is. Oh, so he was never. Oh, that's crazy. These niggas He's still alive, but now the witnesses. Then came out, this nigga academics footage got the nigga standing where he's standing with the I picture. saw that. I do they follow that. They said he shot. The witnesses are saying Quavo and Jay Prince Jr. start arguing. A punch was thrown. Quavo went to throw another punch. They say the nigga in the yellow hoodie was on the side of takeoff. They say he shot takeoff. They witnessed him shoot takeoff in the head and then grab him and use him as a shield. Remember they were saying it was friendly fire. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the shot after the head shot came from a response of the niggas trying to shoot the nigga that they watch shoot take off. Mm-hmm. He used the body oh, as a shield. Him. And that's how he got shot in the torso, probably. There you have it. Makes they was sense. trying to aim at him, and they he used take off as a shield. And then that's when Act had the footage of the nigga making a run for the it. The reason why that makes so much sense is. Also, it was a close proximity shooting. So I'm like, yo, yeah. if it's close proximity like that, a nigga's supposed to shoot the person that they trying to shoot. So Bro. that makes a lot of fucking sense. Like and, and, and remember whack in that first um in that first uh post from one of the witnesses, one of the first witnesses, um, he was saying, you know, a mob ties a uh, person that he wasn't gonna name and everything, and then mm-hmm. he had you know, then he had and said yeah. that he had blamed it on like you know uh Quavo side or whatever as far as shooting. So I don't mixing know. Mixing it up, see that? Yeah, he was mixing it up. See, look, right. I'm gonna tell you the big look, her, and then the daddy with his bozo ass. He talking with all these subliminals, but he's insinuating he knows who it is. You can't come stand behind me. You can't hide behind me. You're only gonna say that about a situation that you know who the fuck it is. This is his job. Right. Is to do this for him. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, yeah like he's absolutely. his own you didn't personal put this long like shit out. Now, mm-hmm. Let me ask you a question, Wack, and you might not answer it. You might not be able to answer it. But do you see this shit blowing up as the catalyst that might fuck up that whole no, operation? No. Violence, because violence fucks with. everything up. It's over, it, bro. The son, the son, and not even the dad. The son. Has just fucked up his dad's whole legacy. That's what I'm asking you. Something he ain't, guess That's what? what I'm asking. That nigga was born rich. Okay? It's, it's fucking you was exactly. born rich, little dude. And you trying to put on this fucking persona, right? With all this dumb shit. You notice it was his dad's actual birthday on Halloween. 